Hey guys, what is going on? It's Jaybird here and welcome to another video. I know I have not uploaded in like two weeks, but I am back now for Origins and today I am uploading a round 80 plus gameplay of Buried. This was from a live stream of mine about two weeks ago, I would say. And it was a pretty good game. I was trying to go for 100, but I kind of failed. I had six downs too, so I didn't really want that on the leaderboard for around 100. So I'm going to try again sometime, maybe, if, if, if I really want to play this map ever again. But in today's commentary, I'm just going to be doing a review of this map. And by the time this video is out, probably Origins will already be released, because I'm doing this commentary pretty close to when it's being released. So I just wanted to say that I'm back. I will be uploading some Origins gameplay, trying to go for those high rounds, maybe doing a live stream this weekend, that would be pretty awesome. Going for the first round 100, but probably someone will get it first day, so. Um, yeah, so I just wanted to give a review of this map on this commentary, so, um, as you guys should probably know, I am a high round zombies player, and for the high round zombie players, this map is pretty shit. Um, the number one thing that makes this map pretty shitty is the fact of the wonder weapon, the paralyzer. It's it's just too overpowered. You should not be able to fly with any gun, no matter what. Like what was Treyarch thinking? Being able to fly with this wonder weapon. Of course strategies like the strategy I'm showing right here are going to be graded. You can fly on top of anything you want, anything you possibly can. You can. You can do anything in zombies. You, they might as well just give us god mode if you're gonna give us a gun that we can fly with that has unlimited ammo. You just have to recharge it for like 10 seconds and it's fully refilled. So, of course, things like this strategy are gonna be made. And it's just so easy. It's not even fun. The last two maps for zombies, Mob of the Dead and Buried, they're both so easy maps. You can literally be AFK for 80% of the game on, on Buried. And Mob of the Dead, it's just so easy because you have like five different things that make the map so easy, but we're doing a review of Buried, not Mob of the Dead. So yeah, just using the turbine and the subsurface resonator along with the paralyzer and with an occasional use of the gas from the Voltrade, you are pretty much unstoppable and it makes a really easy strategy, so I think if they just took out the paralyzer or at least the feature for the paralyzer that you could fly, this map would, wouldn't be nearly as shitty and it would probably be... I would like it a lot better for high rounds if you could not fly with this wonder weapon. But sadly, you can. They're not going to take it out because it's obviously one of the main features of the gun. But they went ahead and made it so that the gun doesn't kill past round 70. Because there's a bunch of glitches. Because you can fly with it. Like That's just like a glitcher's dream. Come on, Treyarch. You can't just... You can't add a weapon to fly with. End of story. Okay, so next thing I do not like about this map. By the way, this is... It's not really a review of this map, it's more of a rant on this map, because pretty much everything about this map is bad. Um, the second thing is just the map layout. It's really a small map. It kind of reminds me of Shangri-La, but a much worse version of it. It's just a really bad design, and the spawns on this map, they only spawn in whatever zone you're in. Not like most maps where they will spawn in the two zones next to you, or even more sometimes. It's usually only two spawns that are next to you. But on this map, they only spawn in the one zone you're in, so it makes it even easier for high rounds. And the gun, the paralyzer, once again, if you are killing zombies with it, it's literally meant for camping. Like, this gun is not made for training up zombies and then killing them. It's literally meant just for camping at places, because it slows them down, and then they'll kill them and then they'll take them a while to spawn. It's just like, it's made for camping. <sighs> and the resonator is too, like obviously the resonator is meant to just stand behind it and let zombies kill it. They they added too many things in this map meant for um, camping. And I mean, I understand that probably raid training has been taken over by what, it's what most people do for high rounds. I do kind of like that this is like the first strategy ever that uses camping, and it's actually the best strategy for the map, but I mean, it's 
really not that fun of a strategy, and it's just too easy, so... Yeah, that's that. And the third thing I wanted to say that I do not like about this map is the fact that you have to use the big guy, Leroy, just to open up everything in the first 10 or 15 rounds. It's just really annoying, but that's how all the Black Ops 2 maps seem to be. There's always something you gotta do in the first 10 rounds or so that's really just annoying. You can't even enjoy it at first. It's like they're trying to make zombies the secondary objective and making everything else on the map the primary objective. Which is not how zombies should be. It's obviously about killing zombies, so that's how it should be. And if they are going to try to make it not zombies, or if they're trying to make zombies like the secondary objective to the game, they need to add more other objectives to the game, because you can pretty much have all buildables, all wonder weapons, all perks, whatever, on round one. And then it just feels like you've already beat the game. So it's like, well, what do I do? I'm basically invincible right now. No point in even playing. It's just so easy. But yeah, that's pretty much my review of this map. It's pretty shitty. I don't even think this map could be fixed. I mean, at least Transit, it has potential. It could be fixed, but this map, just because I do not like the map layout itself, this map might be worse than Transit. I'm still deciding which one I dislike more. I think I'm going more towards Buried now. But yeah, that's all for my Buried gameplay here. I hope you guys like this high round gameplay. The rounds are super fast because they only spawn in the one zone near you, so it's super fast no matter where you are. Um, I will see you guys for Origins. I know I've seen a lot of leaked gameplay of it. It looks really cool. They've added a lot of new guns and crazy stuff. So I will see you guys for that map. And until then, I will see you guys next time. Peace out.